Hello and welcome or welcome back to my little corner of the internet where I like to talk about some witchy shit, some health shit, and some political shit. I am so glad that you are here. I am starting this new year brand spanking new with a new format, a new system, a new program, new editing software. So hopefully it can be better than what we had last year, like overall in society. Um, so I hope you guys are still wearing your masks. Uh, we still have a president that's contesting the election results, which is awesome. Um, and he has a base of followers who are just hell bent on destroying democracy. So that's where we are on that. Um, it's sad. It's maddening. It's uh, scary what's going to come, but uh, we'll get through it. With a little help from our friends, you and this. But seriously, let's, <clears throat> excuse me, let's try to be kind. Let's try to be understanding, compassionate, empathize. Um, you know, all of these good traits that like the religious, uh, which happens to like be very outspoken on the right side. Um, those are kind of like the traits that are encouraged in the religious scriptures, but I don't see that actually panning out in reality, sadly. Um, but we can help to foster that. We can help to introduce more care, more love, more nurturing, more unity, community. Um, I know that we are supposed to be staying distant from each other um, for the foreseeable future until all of this is resolved. I'm not talking politics, but, um, but yeah, we can have a sense of community while still being separate. I know that sounds weird, but social media is a great tool to build a community of people who may not only be like like-minded people, but also others who may not share your viewpoints, but are able to come to an understanding, a mutual agreement that we may have different beliefs, but we can still get along. However, <clears throat> excuse me, um, that does not extend to holding hateful views. That is not tolerated. Name calling, not tolerated. Um, if you feel like doing that on, like yesterday I had people coming on to one of my social media posts and they don't follow me, they have a private account, which is usually how it is. Um, they just lash out, lash out, lash out, and then hide behind a private account. So you can't, do anything. You can't see what else they post. You can't do anything like that. So what did I do? I just let them rant and rant and rant and sound like a deranged lunatic. So that is my tool. That and I also put people like on Twitter, I just mute, you know, so it's like them screaming into an abyss. I don't need that kind of hatred. I don't need that kind of limited viewpoint. I don't need the blinders on of what reality is. I already kind of know what reality is. So that's the political aspect. Health, eh, you know, got a new primary. I have no idea when I'll see her, how she is, um, and if she believes that any of my conditions are real. And if she will, <clears throat> excuse me, stop any of my medications like my previous primary did when she came on board. And then the other day I realized I've been abandoned and handed off by two doctors in the past year as my primary care providers. So that kind of sucks. So that's the health aspect. Um, really trying to focus on my mental health recently, lately, and hopefully carry that into the future because sometimes things get fucked up. You know, um, trauma is an awesome thing that keeps reminding you of, hey, you know what? This happened. This happened. You're trying to go to sleep. Oh, no, this happened. You know, trauma, anxiety, depression, all that fun stuff. So that's the health stuff. 
And then let's get to the witchy stuff because with my new format that I have coming up, I have, thank you for listening to me this far, um, I'm going to be posting three days a week. Um, hopefully with Biden coming in, it's going to be quieter on the political front and I can do a little bit different stuff. So Monday, Wednesday, and Friday are going to be my three main posting days. Um, Monday, I'm going to do like a mantra Monday to help to focus throughout the rest of the week. Wednesday is Witchy Wednesday, um, which, uh, which, which I'm going to be posting like more witchy stuff as the name implies. Uh, I already have the video for this coming Wednesday. Hopefully you guys will like it. And then Friday will be my favorite Friday. You know, um, like some things that I use, some foods, things like that. Just highlighting my favorites, you know? Um, so I think that'll be a fun way to kind of go into this new year with a new format. Um, so for this week's Mantra Monday, it is, I attract people who help me meet my goals. Um, I have a couple of goals. Some may call them resolutions, vision board, plans, you know, like a five-year, 10-year plan. Um, we have a lot of goals to accomplish this year. Um, and a lot of them require assistance in some way or another, whether it be educational, you know, I might need to tap people's brains. Um, if you want to watch the videos uh, that we will be doing in the future, that would be a way to support us as well. Um, and maybe financial, you know, or just a mental hug, kind words go a long way. But w um, the process of meeting goals doesn't always happen in a linear fashion. It can go up and down, up and down, up and down. But the important thing is to learn from each of those downs as well as the ups. And then you can take that information into future endeavors. So try to find somebody maybe that has done what you have done or want to do, you know, to tap their brains to say, okay, how did you do this? YouTube is a great resource for that. Um, and hopefully by putting it out into the universe, you'll be able to attract those kind of people that have done what you want to do have insight and can teach you. Um, and maybe even just be a cheerleader. They may not have done what you want to do, but they can offer you that moral, emotional, even financial support to help you to accomplish your goals. So that is where I will leave you. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in Wednesday's video. Um, let me know down below in the comments uh, what you think of that format idea, as well as what are some of your goals for this coming year. Um, I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, remember to like, comment, subscribe, share, and all that good stuff, as well as wear your mask. And uh, I will see you later. Be kind to yourself and others.